Hello everyone. So in this session we are going to see about fill option. Okay. So let's see what is that. So for that I am going to get this rectangle and I am going to place it over here. Fine. So for giving the input I am going to have this slider. So just click on this rectangle. It will take you to the animation page. Right. So yes. Can you see here percent fill. There is an option called percent fill in the animation. So just we will see the vertical first. What is this fill means? It will be fill with some color. Okay. So whenever you are changing the slider from 0 to 100, it will be filling the, uh, you know, object. So here I have taken that rectangle. No, so it will be started filling. So I will just take this vertical option. So if you click on that vertical option, it will take you to the you know this uh, dialog box in this box you need to give the expression fine so just take the expression of this slider so for slider i have given the tag name called level so i'm going to choose the same tag name okay and this side in the property this side you can see val value at minimum fill 0 this is 100 this is the default settings okay this is the default settings. I am not going to change anything. Fine. I just tag the level. Just go for OK. Go for OK. Now go for runtime. Yeah. So just increase this slider. Yeah. Can you see? Your tank color is changing. Whenever you are increasing, this is also changing. Fine. So if you come down it will again go. Got it? So this is the default settings. Right? So apart from that what are the remaining settings we are having? So just go for the vertical. Instead of up just give down. Okay? So default setting was up. Now I am just giving down. Now go for ok. Ok. Go for runtime. Just increase this. Yes. Can you see? It's like this. It is towards down. It is coming towards down. If Since we have chosen the down option. It is like emptying the tank. Correct. See imagine the tank is full now. If you increase this the tank is empty. It is going down. Right. So this is vertical filling. Okay. So, you have few more options here. One is this maximum and minimum fill. So, the default one is 100. So, what is that 100 means? Since it is a 100, it will be completely filling the tank. Okay. So, now take this to 50. Now, check what it is actually doing. Go for run time. Now, just increase this to 0 to 100. It is filling up to 50 percentage only. Okay. So how much we need to fill whether it is a 100% or 50% like that. So default will be 100. So if you want to change that you can change. Right. So and there is a background color. You can see the background color is black. So if you choose something different. When you go for the online you can see that updated color. Yeah it is yellow color now. Can you see it is. Fine. So this is vertical filling. Vertical filling. Like that we are having horizontal fill also. So just uncheck the vertical. Go for horizontal. Go for the settings. So here also you are tagging the same tag. Let's go for the default settings. Default setting is right. So right means it will take the right side. This side. This, this is right side. Okay. So just go for runtime. Horizontal. Can you see? It is moving towards right side. Okay. Yeah. So this is horizontal. So vertical means it was taking y axis. Since it is a horizontal it is taking x side. X axis. Fine. So here also you can change the direction that to this side. Left side you can change. Direction to left. If you have changed this to left. 
go for okay okay go for run time yeah now it will be towards left side see it is towards left side got it so this is how you need to do the percentage fill here also instead of 100 if you are setting this to 25 let's see what will happen let's check out this go for run time just increase this you can see it is up to 25 okay so yes so like this you can customize this animation property according to the requirement of yours fine so just practice this in the software i'll meet you in the next session with another interesting topic bye